Wagwan and welcome back to the channel. My name is Frank. I hope you're having a great day today. I am, and let's get right into this episode. Last time out, James Kingpin Price had a huge victory. In this episode, we will be going off against Mike Ellis, hopefully with a huge victory. I'll see everybody in our first week, and I'll friend, see how it goes. You are really starting to make a name for yourself. And I've got some of the best trainers. I know world last world time we were here, you. we did I've travel somewhere. Guys, so hopefully this time cool. around, we will go you somewhere. You visit one of them when you get the chance. Now, I'm not too sure where we're going to go, but I know Boss Rudin is talking about a lot of different places. In my mind, I'm thinking of honestly going to Japan, but let's see. But Shudo Club is the one I'm looking at honestly right now. I'm not too sure. I really want to go for that Kimura, and I think that's exactly what we will decide to go for. But Shudo Club it is. Let's head out. I'm not too sure what to expect here, honestly. And if this sounds a little weird, I'm not going to lie, I'm doing a voiceover currently. So if it's a little unsynced, like I don't know what's about to happen, or if I'm not reacting to it live, it's because I'm not. This is a post commentary, and I totally forgot to have my mic Please recording my audio. I am Fujimoto Hidea. But here we are with Fujimoto Hidekai. I'm not even sure how to pronounce that Japanese last name. I'm probably sure you are ready. I just killed it. But. We're looking to get that Kimura, of course. That was the main move we it's came here for. To stop the drip. Let's continue working on this Kimura right now. It says get to full mount postured up before time runs out. Nice and easy. Break the clinch. We're looking to maybe do something with it. And a beautiful takedown ends up having us move into the next position. Your next Already into a full mount postured up within nine seconds, 10 seconds, something like that. And we're definitely ready. Kimura definitely in the bag, ready to go. Hopefully, we won't have any more issues. I think I'm just gonna go over here and do some takedown training, and I'll probably see everybody when it is time for the fight after this. You have got it. Beautiful this is takedown. The kind of effort Let's see if I get up. Nice and easy. I think I gotta do five takedowns in this drill. Here's the second That's takedown. Nice. Find that rhythm. And the second That's get up. It. Nice and easy. The third one after a leg kick. Beautiful. Great effort. Goes right down Keep to the mat. Nice and easy. Denkins, the training partner here in Japan. Here's the fourth takedown the intensity. and the fourth Keep it get going. up. And with this takedown, it will all be over and we will be ready. To Your next opponent this fight. is going to quit on you or if you actually, keep that up. I'm going to do these training drills. I'm going to keep simulating them. And when they are done, I will see everybody before the fight. It is that time once again for the fight of his career. I'm not sure how much time I got to introduce this, but we were going against Mike Ellis with a two and four record. I'm feeling good about going down there and winning it on the ground. I'll see how it turns out. Stay tuned, everybody, because this fight right here is one for the history books. Second fight in the UK, and I'll see everybody when it's time for the fight. I am here live with the tail of the tape. Let's see, I'm gonna break it down and then allow the game to take it over. Six foot, or excuse me, 5'11", 246 for Mike Ellis, and we know everything else about him. I'm gonna allow the commentating uh, officiating crew to take it over. Honestly, I'm not gonna commentate for the rest of this one since my mic did get messed up. Enjoy, everybody. Leave a like if you enjoy. And I'll talk to everybody at the end of the episode. This man is a brawler fighting out of New Zealand, Mike Ellis. And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a wrestler, fighting out of the United States, James Kingpin Rice. Fight already? Fight already? Let's go, fight! We begin this fight. Beautiful counter to the takedown attempt. Oh, this is a nice sprawl. Hips down, back straight. He's stopping that takedown. Good one. Do it again. And a double leg takedown puts him on the floor. He's able to transition into half guard. He's past the half guard now into side control. Price is looking to score with some punches from side control. He's on top of him now. 
he scores with that right to the head. Good one, do it again. Oh, he's in trouble here. He is in deep trouble. Yup, he's given up his back. This could be it. Ellis lands a left punch to the head. He stops the takedown attempt. Great job at securing the back, and he is really in control now. Price scores his first kick of the fight. He's working from the guard, and he stacks him up. That's a great position to be in if you're the top guy. If you're the bottom guy, you got to break him down or get ready to move your head. Here we see him stacked up in the guard now. He's stacking them up. Oh, it looks like he's going to engage in the sprawl and brawl tactics. There's a textbook sprawl as he defends the take price. Takes him down. Oh, man, he shoots right into a guillotine attempt. This could be trouble. You're not a lot of pain in this hole, but there's a lot of pressure in your head. Feels like your head's going to pop. And just before that, Wallace. The submission eludes him. He is unable to finish it this time around. He transitions into half guard. Yes, that's nice. <sighs> Ellis lands a right punch to the head. He moves from half guard into cross side position. Bryce connects with a left punch to the body. <sighs> He passes the guard and moves into side control. He lands a punch. Beautiful sprawl as he shoots his feet out from behind and is able to nullify this takedown attempt. He stops the head kick and that may have kept him on his feet. Price lands a left punch to the head. Way to be! Price throws a nice high kick! Oh, he darts out of the way of that punch. Ellis goes for the head kick! What a shot! There's an effective combination. That's a win! Keep it up! Price lands a left punch to the head. He dumps him with a double leg take. They say if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Will he be able to get the submission this time? Wow, I can't believe. Oh, and there he's able to escape that choke submission. And we are back to a battle here. There you go. Nice elbow. The elbow is a dangerous weapon, especially when it connects with your face. Wow, nice transition. He has the back, and this is where this fight could end. Oh, what a confidence builder. When you have someone's back, and you... Uh-oh, he could be... Oh, this choke looks really, really tight. This could be it. Oh, he's sucking the life out of him with this choke. He's got to get some positional movement. Wow, just as quickly as it began, it's already over. He can't get the submission. He didn't really get anything from that attempt. Wow. That didn't take long at all. Looks like it never happened. Patience is a virtue, and he was able to wait for the right moment in order to execute that reversal. Great job in passing the guard right into full mount. Round one is now over. Oh, he's given up his back, and this could be the beginning of the end. It's a bad position, Mario. He's got to get hand control immediately, and he's got to turn and face his opponent. Fight already? Let's go. Fight! The next round has begun. Price puts him down on the canvas with a double leg takedown. Oh, no doubt about it. He is looking for the Americana here. Oh, that hurts my shoulder just looking at it. He's got it completely locked. I think I can hear those tendons popping. 
Ellis avoids this attempt at the Americana. Wow, that was lightning quick. What a reversal. Wow, what a major transition as he goes from guard right into full mount. That's a beautiful... Oh, he's in trouble here. He is in deep trouble. Yup, he's giving up his back. This could be it. Yes, that's nice. There's a solid left punch to the head. Oh, some pretty impressive defense on display as he was able to use his quick reflexes to block what looked like a knockout head kick. He's frozen him up! He's frozen! That punch might be the beginning of the end. His opponent is down on the canvas. Beautiful ending to the fight. Exactly what we wanted to see from James Kingpin Price. A beautiful victory. I just want to say thank you very much for tuning in. If you enjoyed, drop a like down below. Subscribe for more daily uploads. I know this one was a bit of a different feel. My mic did die on me. And let's hear the official decision. James Kingpin. Let's go once again. James Kingpin Price getting another victory. A beautiful one at that. And next episode as well, it will probably be a little bit more of this. Um, I did not realize that my mic was not recording and I decided to record two videos at once. So just bear with me on this one. Once again, Frank in the boxing slash octagon ring with James Kingpin Price. Just want to say thank you for tuning in. Stay safe, everybody. And peace out until tomorrow.